Today, we're going to introduce you the latest Daemon bracket system, Daemon Ultima. There are two innovations. First, the wire change. Second, the bracket slot geometry change. Let's look at the wire first. Typically, our wires are either round or rectangular. Daemon Ultima assemble both wires into one. The new round-sided rectangular wire, which is half round and half rectangular. The wire size varies. However, with the new wire, it ends with 0275 inch. The Ultima wire progress with round copper first, then change into Ultima wire in order to achieve earlier tooth control, for example, rotation control. The green words down here is our Beethoven prescription. So let's make a one-on-one -on -one battle between Damon Q and Ultima. For rotation control, it is the bracket door and the base of the slot that engage the wire. With the previous version, there is a 4 degree freedom of rotation for the wire. However, with the new round side of the Ultima wire, it is able to touch the bracket and reduce the play to maximum 1 degree. As for torque control, to flare this tooth out, we'll need high torque bracket as shown on the right side of screen. We can see with Damon Q, there's about 12 to 13 degree of wire play. However, with Ultima, the wire is locking pretty good with exquisite torque control. So those were the wires. What about the bracket? Let's look at the bracket innovation. Often, we might encounter this vertical discrepancy among teeth during the finishing stage, and we'll bend the 16 by 25 stainless steel wire, which is very technique sensitive to relieve the vertical discrepancy. But why does this happen? This is because with the preceding bracket, torque was placed in the stem. Thus, if we take the bracket base as reference when bounding bracket, you could not get level slot alignment. We'll have to imagine the center line of the slot. To get rid of this burden, Damon upgrade the bracket and make it even better. The solution is to place torque in the slot instead of the stem. This leads to the innovative parallelogram slot geometry for high and low torque and thus making the center line on the same level. So let's use this table to wrap up all the information. With the new wire, we get less play and thus becoming more precise and efficient. Also, with the parallelogram slot geometry, we are able to bend wire less and have more tie wing space. So that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Consider subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you.